This one came under the all-or-nothing category for Rovers, who simply couldn't afford to think about relegation. Last week's win over Alawa had given them some breathing space, and they were breathing a bit more easily after 21 minutes, thanks to Paul Tosh. It didn't take long to increase the lead after the break, J. Steen making it look easy. We've seen a few good goals this week, this one of them, and Rovers now in the clear. And that gave them the confidence to make this one of the most impressive games of the season. That confidence again was underlined by Steen just three minutes later. And the goals and the day were simply getting better for Rovers. With the air comfortably ahead of Alloa at this stage, the home fans knew their side was safe and they were soon celebrating again. It's Tosh with his second and the fourth for the home side. The icing on this particular kick came from Steen. Let's see how this one compares to his two previous goals. No, Wraith are safe and Peter Hellerston can put away the Grecian 2000 for a few months. Peter, you were quoted as saying that was the biggest game of your career if you got a result today. Do you still believe that? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, starting off the man's yield career, uh, as I said, I achieved a wee bit of the football side of things and I think this was a major hurdle for me to come over my man's Euro career. But a lot of great support from people who have been in the game a long time, phoned me up and tell me just to keep in there and at the end of the day it'll work out for you. And if I could keep Wraith Rovers in the first division, after all what's happened over the last the month, the past months, it would have been a wonderful achievement and it's, I really feel it's been.